Hey, I'm Jeff with Avid Max, and here I've got one of the fish pond nets. This is their boat net, and even though it just kind of looks like a normal net and you think all of them are the same, uh, there's a couple of different features about this one that might make it a little bit nicer, as well as um, there might be some of you that are still out there using kind of one of those uh, old school nets and, and are really looking for an upgrade, especially to one of these that have the rubber nets to them. So these are a, a lot nicer than kind of the traditional uh, cloth or whatever they are that you're using there that is a net because these are gonna be, first they're gonna be a lot better for the fish. And one of the other things that is a lot nicer about these rubber nets as well is that you won't really be getting your fly caught in all of the webbing in the middle. So like I said, this is the fish pond boat net. It measures about 55 inches tall, um, and the net on it is actually pretty deep. So it's a little over a foot. It is a 14 inches there. And these nets have a couple of great things going for them. One of the things you're gonna notice on the handle of these nets is that it is made of a pretty cool material here. So it's got a, a nice rubberized handle on this that's just gonna make it really easy to grip even when it gets wet, which is <laughs> kind of one of the necessary features of a net. But you'll also see that along the handle here, it has a ruler. That way, when you are out fishing with a buddy and he says he catches his nice little 18 inch trout there, you can pull your net out and show him maybe it wasn't as big as he thought it was. One of the other great things about these nets though is that even though this is a boat net, we've all been in that spot where you're kind of reaching out trying to get the fish and for whatever reason, you lose grip of the net. These are all light enough that they also float. So if you do happen to drop the, the net in the water, it's not gonna sink, it's just gonna stay right there on the top for you. While nets seem pretty self-explanatory and there's not a whole lot of extra that needs to be said about them, there are a few reasons that you wanna use a net for, for all of your fish and, and use them properly. So after you've got your fish in your net, there's kind of that, uh, that tendency to pull then the fish out of the water to be able to, to look at it, show other people, things like that. But one of the great things about this net, especially with as deep of a basket as it has, is you can just keep the fish right there in the water. So just let the net stay in there. You can take your pictures of the fish while it's in the water and just hold them there while you're getting all your gear ready. You can even be able to keep the fish in the water as you're working with a little bit just to get the, the fly out of its mouth there. All in all, the, uh, the carbon fiber, fiberglass mixed uh, boat net here from Fish Bond is a great net. And if you're looking for one this size, it's gonna be hard pressed to find a better net. For more fly fishing and outdoor related videos, subscribe to our Avid Max YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you out there.